gravity. Previously on Defying Gravity. Sharon, come in. Donner! Sharon, you copy. Donner! Launch now, Donner! Launch now. Oh, forgive me. I know Donner and I coming on board last minute is a little awkward. Not for me. Just remember how much I love you. I think the obvious question is simply what the hell happened? One minute we're on the mission, the next minute we're off. Something's happening. And I need to know why. <laughs> Paula Puke, queen of the upchuck, mistress of heave. <laughs> it's talking to her again. My withdrawal symptoms are under control, doctor. So, what are you doing there? You working on the rabbit embryos? You're changing the subject. And AJ, will he be coming back on the floor? Goss wants to do a thorough psyche eval. If he passes, he won't pass, Rowley. AJ once told me that the idea of a man knowing everything about something is folly. His word, not mine. He said that man, by his very nature, is dependent on other men. We need each other to survive. Yeah. I'll get that. Uh, I got it. I can get it. I can get it, too. The problem is getting anybody to admit that. You must be feeling better. I'm starving. And I've got lots of catching up to do. My space classroom, the lander G and C. You know, if you need some help, I Steven, can. I can count on this spork more than you. As a species, we pride ourselves on being self-sufficient. No Form 24 today. You guys know what to do? Why ask a stranger for directions? We'd rather stay stubborn and lost. How many times have you been back? Three. And all I see is a storm. So how does it make you feel? What do you mean? I mean, how does it make you feel? Afraid? Alone? What's your response to it? I'm just trying to help you through this. Eve, all I see is a storm. I'm in a Martian storm. Good morning, Frenchie. You look way too good to be in withdrawal. I am switching my batches as we speak. I think I'm through the worst of it. You look awful. Not getting a whole lot of sleep. Wanna talk about it? No good shrink. As long as his office is in six million kilometers away. Well, then you're out of luck. How's Ted? Uh, he's distant, but he's doing his job. Whatever Raleigh said to him did the trick. Maybe you should talk to Raleigh. AJ's still on med watch, Donner. Can't come on the floor until he's cleared. Well, you're on the floor, Raleigh. I didn't need a psych eval. He did. That's simple. Strikes me as damn stupid to have me up here running systems checks without the engineer who helped design it. Point taken. This better not be one of Goss's games. No, it's not, Donner. Smells like it. It's not. So how come I haven't heard from AJ? He has restricted access until he's cleared. Roger that. I'll run the check alone. See you so soon. Didn't expect to be back so soon. <laughs> I'll have the chicken curry. All right. So, water with lime? No, I think I'll have a beer. The nuclear reactor on Antares will power four redundant electrical subsystems. Now, on the Mars missions, we were primarily solar, so this is a big improvement. 
For safety reasons, each of the subsystems is discreetly located on the ship. Charmy, you have your hand in the air. Yes. Do you need the exercise or do you have a question? Your information is actually out of date. There's three subsystems now. Budget cuts. <laughs> I'm sorry? The change is very recent. Uh, my sponsoring company designed it. I was on the team. Oh, well, then we're very fortunate to have you here, aren't we? I don't know what the hell I'm doing up here flapping my gums when we have the designer in the house. Donna. Come on, Charma, you know everything. Why don't you get your ass up here and share it with us? Some large, hefty man balls you got swinging down there. Dude, no, man. Donner, in class, make him look like a chump? I. Takes a pair to do that, especially when he's on the rag. Rag? What do you mean? Well, you don't look this? What? It's the fifth anniversary of the Mars disaster today, man. Look at him. Donner's ready to take that bag out. But good on you, man. Grinding his face and his shortcomings, he needed it. Oh, I'm cramping. I gotta go take a steam. Life on the ship is an adjustment for everyone. The close quarters, the distance from Earth, the responsibility we have to help our fellow crew members. One of the biggest adjustments we make is to the lack of gravity. Just ask your host, Paula Puke. Here in our quarters, we have natural gravity caused by the centrifugal force of our spinning rotors. But in the rest of the ship, we create artificial gravity with magnetism and our grav suits. Jorge from La Escuela Guerrera in Santiago, Chile asked why our hair doesn't fly. Una excelente pregunta, Jorge. Let's find out. What do you have in your hand, Zoe? This is nano spray. We use it on our hair and non-standard clothing to make it slightly magnetic. Can you show us how it works? Sure. You just uh, give your hair a couple of good shots. And voila. <laughs> Porcupine head. <laughs> Kalinda. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> OK, who just turned out the lights? Was that the ship or the camera? That's the ship. Funny. Flight, we have a primary subsystem electrical failure. Donner, tell me that's you running a systems check. Uh, negative, Mike. I'm trying to get it back up now. Looks like some kind of short or a bus failure. Can you bypass it? Uh, no, that's not working. I'm gonna have to go back and take a look. In the meantime, you guys better start looking for AJ. We're not wasting time looking for AJ, people. Start looking for solutions. I hear they put it on the menu just for you. It's an astronaut bar. They like to keep us happy. <laughs> I've had that curry. You can't be that happy. <laughs> it's not exactly like home, is it? Right, yes. And now that you have so subtly reminded me we used to be subjects of the same crown, you should sit and we should talk because, well, we share the bond of flag and curry. Exactly. That was not a sincere offer. No, I'm aware of that. Can I have, I'll have what he's having? Thanks a lot. So, um, do you know what I did before I was assigned here? I watched you every night on the evening news. Mm. Yep, a heady time ruined by a single act of hubris. I guess the lesson is that journalists should not make up their stories, hmm? And, of course, astronauts shouldn't really go on unauthorized spacewalks. I was fixing the shield. I exposed a crooked politician. AJ. It doesn't matter, Mr. Williams. That's my point exactly, though, isn't it? Here we are, you and I, both exiled from what we should be doing, seeking some kind of redemption. And maybe we should be helping each other. Oh, thanks. Lovely. Looks just how I remember. Oh, I understand they're having a, a bit of a power problem on the Antares this morning. It's a shame not consulting you, really, you know. With your, uh... Excuse me. Yeah, of course. I have to go to the men's room. Right. 
Oh, God. It's just how I remember. Have you got any um, mango chutney or anything? Just to... Yeah. Hey, Jay? Is anyone left in their bay? No. What are well, you doing? I'm trying to figure out why anyone would think that Scott Summers is a better leader than Jean Grey. I mean, the Sentinels alone... I like your hair. You remind me of my mom. What? There's something wrong. Yeah, I know. Look at her. Yeah, we were using a mag. <laughs> Looks good. We're going to the flight deck now. Come on. Let's go. Vamanos. What's the point? It's just a bus failure. Donner's probably got it under control. Flight. It's not a bus failure, and all the Brayton circuits check out nominal. I'm gonna have a look up in the node. It's the only place the electrical subsystems meet. What are you doing? You try to find the problem, and I'll try to find your sex drive. It's been missing since you got here. Seriously, no, it's... Mm. Don't you want to try to wake us? Hmm? Oh, damn. Do you have to leave a mark? Always? Just laying claim to my territory. Your territory's got some work to do. All right, flight, we're going off grab in half sector four. See? You worry too much. So? H2IK. And H2IK is bad? H2IK could be as bad as it gets. Sector 4 going back on graph. I think I worry just enough. Too much, and that's why nobody likes you. You swim in a sea of self-delusion, Moss. Okay, if I'm swimming in it, you're drowning. What was that? I think it's the rotor arm. This rotor arm? Yep. This rotor arm. All right. What we know is that the failure is inconsistent. Bridges all of the subsystems and is somehow related to the MagGrav in our sector four. The MagGrav checks out nominal, so it's related but not connected. We need to look at code as well as schematics and run a full systems check. Okay. Go to work, people. They got it covered. And you gotta get to the hospital. We should have operated the day Aging Raleigh came home. Did we really think he was going to get rid of their plaque? It's changing the crew's genes. Anything's possible. It doesn't give us permission to be negligent. <clears throat> Hi. Hi. Thanks for calling. Most guys would have called the producers first. How do you know I didn't? And I expect a little quid pro quo here, of course. Oh, of course you do. Hey, AJ. How are you? I'm fine. I'll be fine. Tell me about the electrical problem. I'm young guys. After you come out of surgery, AJ, it's just a glitch. How bad is he? He's in surgery, but the good news is they don't have to replace the valve. But what about Raleigh? He'll have the same plaque procedure this afternoon. No one's taking any chances. Look, this is emotional for all of us, okay? But let's not lose focus on the ship. Worst case. I mean, besides no AJ to get us out of this, Progressive overloads leading to a systemic shutdown like the New England blackouts last year. I mean, that's a long shot, but... I don't understand. The systems are redundant. Can't we switch from one subsystem to the other? Yeah, the ship's programmed to do that automatically, and it's been trying. This is somehow bridging systems. Uh, I'm gonna check the exterior maintenance panels for damage. NEVA, I'm in. Donna only. You and Zoe can prep them and help with the egress and the ingress. I'll be on the flight deck monitoring. Well, if this shutdown is systemic, we could lose power in the labs. I have embryos that could freeze. Then all of you should secure what you can and work in teams. Watson, and Paula coming down? He didn't want to leave. She stayed with him. It's getting really cold in here, Was. This is stupid. It's going to be fine. Any minute, the rotor arm... Oh. Just twist and grab on... Yeah, I know how to do it. There's gravity on the flight deck. 
And heat. Well, then go ahead and leave. I'm really going. So really go, then. Fine. I'm leaving. Good. Do you have a rash, Donner? I don't think so. It is really red behind you. Are those teeth marks? I think Ted sent you down here to keep an eye on us. Um, what's the word for that? Chaperone. The word is chaperone, and it's not necessary. Then Zoe can go. No, Zoe will stay. Only because Ted assigned me, not because I want to. This has got to be hell on him. You know, on both of them. I can't imagine flipping that switch, leaving two people behind. Donna was sleeping with her. What? Who? Sharon Lewis, big Romans. That's why you won't touch any of the Askins. Too much potential drama. Oh. Donna? I, uh... I didn't mean anything in the classroom today. I mean, I wasn't trying to show you up or anything. I just thought it's the most recent information. You know, when I worked for the company, there was always this pressure whenever a supervisor came around having to know absolutely everything about absolutely everything, which is obviously impossible. My team I came up with a code in case one person got stuck, somebody else could come and relieve them. We called it an H2IK sequence. What's an H2IK sequence? It means hell if I know. It's H2IK, it's hell if I know. Hey, Sharma. Yeah? No one to shut up. Conventional wisdom says it's forbidden to ask, but I am a shrink, so. Want to talk about it? You want to talk about those beauty marks? It's a simple cardio cath. They break up the plaque sonically, then suck it out. Yeah, I'll be able to walk off the table. Huh. Ev, you all right? Yeah, I just, uh, hate that. Well, it's probably just the boys down at Mission Control playing with a mag grab, but they're laughing at us right now. Are you all right if we... I can manage if you can. Okay. Okay, I'll see you in a bit. All right. that Donna you're go for a walk this is one hell of a backyard we got Ted Roger that we know it's connected to the mag grab switches in off sector four we knew that three hours ago and everything we do to pinpoint it seems to be making it worse look I just told the president of the United States that we'd have this cleared up by tomorrow morning don't make a lie about it three of us are going to be up here together for over six years, right? And I know that you and Donner are going to screw, not boots. Whatever. 
a red-blooded guy, and you're throwing yourself at him. I don't have to throw myself at him. We've been sleeping together for years. Fine, you have, yes. And with a little room, I can handle it. But up here... Up here, down there, we are going to do it, whether you like it or not. Of course. Just don't flaunt it at me, okay? Don't scar his body with little intimacies for me to see. Can you do that for me, Nadia? Because he is all yours. We are not competing. We've never been competing. I'm a friend with benefits to Donna, nothing more. The person you've been competing with is Sharon Lewis. Ted, I'm looking at pristine panels. Roger that. They look as good as the day they were installed. I see no damage to the ship at all. She's beautiful. Then you should come in. Roger that. Heading back to the airlock now. supposed to overlook the obvious possibility do you honestly think after all these years in the direction it so clearly pushed us in beta simply wants to strand your spacecraft nothing else makes sense something will you guys just have to find it and what is williams doing down here quid pro quo for sitting on aj in raleigh the press is all over this electrical glitch anyway he's just getting a better view Donna, are you coming in? Donna, do you copy? What is he doing? Donna, do you have a problem? Come back to me. People mind if I join you? Trevor Williams, British Television News. We know who you are. Oh, okay, good. Oh, oh, sorry. Yes. Yeah, sure. Copper squat. Thanks very much. No problem. So I assume you're all here for the uh, for the show, are you? Actually, we're a little unsure what we're doing here. I mean, aside from the fact that it's the anniversary of the Mars mission. Well, that's exactly the point, isn't it? Tonight we get to be witnesses to prolonged torture, disguised as tradition. Bring single malts, Tom. The finest island. Someone will. There is no greater calling than to be an explorer. No greater ambition than to stretch the knowledge and reach of mankind. And there is glory and success, but it rides on the back of personal sacrifice. And it is that sacrifice that we salute here tonight. We raise our glasses to two explorers who gave their lives, who reached as far as man has ever reached and paid the ultimate price. They were friends, 
They were colleagues. And they were true heroes. Sharon Lewis and Jeff Walker, you inspire us. You humble us. And you will never be forgotten. Okay. What just happened there? Am I clueless? Well, that goes without saying. Clever. I don't think anyone could have said anything that would have made Donna feel better. That's not the point, AJ. Gosh just made Donna and Ted toast their own failure, toast killing the woman he loved. Well, so then why do it? Why, why show up at all? Well, that's the question, isn't it? Why allow Goss to torture you year after year? Easy. Goss picks the crews. You'll do it to fly. Donna, my man, this had better be a joke. Talk to me. Do you copy? I can go out, help him back in. No one else leaves this ship. Talk to me, Donna. Doing? Donna, you are outside of your flight plan. Get back to the ship now. Flight. We just lost Donna. Where does he think he's going? I have no idea. Donna! Antares, this is flight. Get him back on the ship. Whatever you think you're doing, stop it. We need you back on the ship. Donner, this is Zoe. Do you read? Damn it, Donner. I need you, Donner, stop. Donner, I need you to come back to me. Zoe? Donner, do you copy? Yeah, I hear you, Z. You took off on us there, madman. Roger that. I thought I saw something come off the ship. Uh, I'm headed back to the airlock now. We copy. Men only listen when they want to. You saw something come off the ship. Yeah. What something what? would come off the ship? It's like a panel or something. I don't... So you chased after it? Yeah, I chased after it. Why? Who did you stop? Please, Donner's in. That's what matters. Not terrific. Mission control? You guys playing with me down there? Guys? Mission control, are you on comm? Ted? That's a third stage failure. 
Half the calm is down. We can start thinking about a progressive blackout. Okay, we're going to need to call in some outside help from the contractors. Uh, how about some inside help? AJ Sharma should be sufficiently recovered by now. I think your quid pro quo just expired, Trevor. I'll have a guard escort you back to the press floor. Over half of the ship is out. They're not telling me squat. They're telling you anything? Not enough. We need AJ. Yes, we need AJ. He should be conscious now. You know how Goss feels. Screw Goss. It's our ship. It's his command. It's our ship, Ted. Show? Uh, takes a particular kind of jackass. That he is. You know, I understand the whole isolated, I can do anything, stud astronaut part of you. I, I really do. But it doesn't unman you to need someone else at certain times. I just really don't think you should be alone tonight. You're right. Good night. Calliope, this is Zeus. We're showing that the dust is breaching your thruster controls. This storm's on the rise. We're losing your launch window. Copy that, Zeus. Yeah, it's looking bad down here. How far out are they? 100 meters. We're holding. Hey. Hey, brother. You know, three things. Burn that damn recording. We're never gonna toast again. And from now on, we never spend this anniversary alone. AJ. Yes, your command, but it's our ship. We want AJ. Negative, he's not healthy. Yeah, neither is the ship. If he's conscious, he'll want to help save it. What do you have to lose? Mike. Get the schematics, the test data, and an uplink to the hospital. Right away, sir. Look who came back. I never left. I was in my quarters. Do you have any sweaters? Yeah, Laura left Bill. You don't have to do this, you know? Yeah, Wallace, I really do. Why? I mean, why help me after the whole Paula Butte business? Is it the whole Jesus said turn it thou cheek it thing? <laughs> It's not because of the whole Jesus thing. Well, then why? It's because you'll freeze to death if I don't. Yeah, that's a good point. Evram? Evram? Are you in here? Evram? Surgical is more astute than diagnostic. Listen, we're in a spot up here. Kind of hoping you had a can of monkey grease laying around for our squeaky door. I've seen the 1500 briefs. Is there anything you can add to them? No, that's about it. You get a chance to take a look? Yeah. And? From what I have here, it looks to me like an H2IK sequence. H2IK, huh? 
sure? I'm positive. Start at the beginning, work your way through it. It's the only way to complete the sequence. Okay. Okay. Roger that. That's what we'll do. We'll start and uh, work that sequence from the beginning. All right, you get better, AJ. Demand sponge baths from the nurses. You deserve it. Okay. Fix it, daughter. So eight's two, okay? Yeah, it stands for hell if I know. He didn't know what it is. It's time, Wasp. We have to get out of here. Come on, what are you so afraid of? I'm not af People are just wired differently, okay? And maybe, maybe we don't necessarily like the way we're wired, but, but that's the way it is. And wanting to be different is just a waste of time, so why bother? Well, that's all you're getting. What happened, Devlin? Where were you? In the war. Lights triggered it. Post-traumatic stress syndrome? And this never happened during training? <sighs> I've been... Medicating for alcohol withdrawal. I think these patches are bad. Does Claire know? Of course she knows. Well, we'll just keep it between you and me then. So he had no idea? None. I didn't want to burn him with gas anymore. <sighs> we could always turn around. Not an option. Why? Why continue on a dead ship? We could direct abort and be home in a month. I'm just saying. Look, there's a solution, all right? Uh, to every problem, there's a solution. We just have to go back and work it from the beginning. It's not software. Ted went through everything in the mainframe. It has to be hardware has to be a short. It can't be a simple short. This entire ship is polymer coated to avoid that exact thing. They wrench in these circuits and that's it. What is it? The MacGraph. We already looked here. What is it? The short seems to go on and off with the MagGrav, and it's jumping subsystems like it's moving, right? So? So, you ever hear one of those stories about a doctor who sews up a patient, but he accidentally leaves a clamp in somebody's chest? <sighs> Back in the dark ages. Well, if the circuit housing and the insulation's too thin, then for some reason, there's a large enough piece of stray... Conductive metal, you wind up with all kinds of problems. assembly wrench by yay big straddling all three bus lines. MagGrav kept shifting around, and that's what kept me from seeing it in the first place. Well, good thinking, Donner. That didn't come from me. OK. AJ hadn't had me run that H2IK sequence, I'd have never found it. We need AJ on the floor, Mike. <sighs> Listen, I'm not prepared to. We need AJ. 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 Put him back on the floor as soon as he's healthy, Mike. Don't test us. In the hall thruster, xenon gas is injected into the chamber, where it's passed through a hall current and stripped of electrons. Yes? What's a hall current? That's a good question. Uh, 
That's the whole current right there, okay? It's a current, and it was first discovered by a guy named Hall uh, back in the, uh, I believe it was the 1800s. Uh, and Hall, who was also an early pioneer of the H2IK sequence, uh, yes. Sorry, is that Edwin Hall? Was it his sequence that showed that when electric and magnetic fields are set perpendicular to each other inside a conductor, that an electric field flows in a direction perpendicular to both fields? Yep, exactly right. That's the Hall current. Answer your question? Yeah. Okay, moving on. Like it or not, man by his very nature is dependent on other men. We call ourselves explorers, independent, courageous. AJ, we're reinstating you. Welcome back to the floor. But what are we without the support of our brothers? I mean, how far do we really get if we try to do everything alone? The simplest, smallest thing can bring the whole world around you grinding to a halt. I want peace of mind. Donna? The guys whipped up some dinner and quarters. I want to rely on my brother. I'll be right down. I know that he'll find the wrench if I don't. And Defying Gravity continues next Thursday night. Wonderland meets the past winners of University Challenge. That's over on BBC Two now, and here on BBC HD, a little music next.